We have to change minds. And I don't simply mean convincing theists to give up their religious beliefs. We have to change the mind of the theists who dislike and disparage atheists without knowing anything at all about them. We have to change the mind of the individuals who care more about whether their beliefs are comforting, appealing, and shared by their family than whether those beliefs are true. We have to change the minds of the media about how relevant non-believers are. There's no press outside today. We got a freaking free thought convention in Tulsa, Oklahoma, and there's not one damn reporter out there. We have to change the minds of the voters and make them aware of the impact that their elected representatives can have on everything from the Supreme Court right down to the local school board and the local groups. And the significance of those smaller elections can't continue to be overlooked. It's not just Washington that makes policy that affects us. We have to change the mind of atheists who feel that they're alone. We have to change the mind of atheists who don't feel that activism has any value. We have to change the minds of network executives who don't feel like there's a market for secular programming. And we have to change the minds of university officials who don't feel that public debate has a place on their campus. We have to change the minds of the apathetic, disenfranchised, despondent, individuals to create active, dedicated, and passionate, passionate representatives. We need to build a world where no child's mind is polluted with fear-inducing superstition, where no one is made to feel that they were born bad or wrong or in need of forgiveness for who they are, where equality is prized, where freedom is cherished, where respect for ideas is proportioned in accordance with the evidence supporting them, where reason and empathy are the premier guide of our moral considerations instead of authoritarian dogma. Where diversity doesn't breed the sort of harmful divisiveness that creates the us versus them mentality that we endure on a daily basis. Where what you believe is less important than why you believe it and far less important than what you do about it where the rights of the minority aren't sacrificed on the might makes right altar of the majority. And we do this by continuing the work we've already done. We create more blogs, more wikis, more podcasts, more local groups, more medium-sized groups, more state groups, more conventions, more of everything. We educate the people within our groups and we send them out, not like an army, but like a collection of people who care about other people and the world we live in. We've been doing good. The nuns, the people who don't associate with any religion, the largest growing religious group on the planet. Some people think we've got it turned up to 10. We have to turn it up to 11.